Praise the Lord, everybody. I said, praise the Lord, everybody. This is the day that the Lord has made, and let us rejoice and be glad in it. Hey, this is Reverend Rob coming with you, two-minute inspiration. Two minutes is what I promise, and two minutes is what I will deliver. The question today is, what is your purpose? What is your purpose? The Bible says in Romans chapter 8, verse 28, and we know that all things work together for good of them that love God and called according to his purpose. My brothers and sisters, it is imperative for your life, for your health, and for your relationship with God that you find out what your purpose is. You see, life comes in three bags. Our health is one, our finances is one thing, and our relationship with God. And if your purpose is wrapped up and tied up and tangled up in the things of God. Third, John 2 says, Beloved, I wish above all things that thou prosper, be in health, even as thy soul prospereth. God wants us to be healthy, wealthy, and saved. That is the mandate. That should be your purpose every day you wake up. I want to have a great relationship with the great God that loves me so much that he allowed his son to die for me. I want God to be pleased with me. I want to walk by faith and not by sight. It is impossible to please God without faith. So you got to get that part right first. Then we got to work on our health. We got to be healthy. I can't do anything for God if I can't, I'm not healthy. I can't do anything for my family or myself if I'm not healthy. And then we got to get our finances together. Amen. Let that be your purpose for the rest of 2020 and the rest of your life. Healthy, wealthy, and saved. What is your purpose? God bless you. Share this message. Amen.